So I started making a docking board from today. So here you can see I fixed two motors on the chassis. So right now I have my rear bumper ready and caster attached to it. So that it will move in on the direction. So turns out I was I had the caster on the wrong side, bumper and everything on the wrong side. So now I have it with the wheels on and I have the rear bumper over here. Yeah. Yes, so you can see it's pretty close. So this is the Raspberry Pi, the brand of the bot that I'm building. It's a microcontroller. It has a HDMI plug, Ethernet plug, and four USB plug. So yeah, there are pins, input output pins, and there there is a place to insert micro SD, and like there, there are these are for cameras, I guess. So I'm going, I'm going to attach these two heat sinks on here and here are the two chips. So the function of these heat sinks is that whenever the Raspberry Pi gets heated, it absorbs heat and prevents it from too hot to set this computer working i have to set something on my uh, pc so i'm doing that right now so after half an hour of trying to figure out what i want to do i finally have authenticated to the docky down website and i have like username and login and whatnot and yes this is and we have the circle sticker on the back bumper so it doesn't look ugly and there might be some other functionalities for this because these have like some patterns I'm not sure why we need specific patterns but yeah so yes it's ready to ride I believe I have done the connection well and everything is working so let me try and turn on the battery yeah so it looks like everything is put together and yeah here we got our docubot ready I set it up and now I'm networking you can see the little light down there are glowing alternately red and green and it's the data transfer happening through Wi-Fi it's pretty interesting now she can walk and using my computer keyboard 